What is up, my Poke Peeps? Marion here, back with another Pokemon cards opening, and today we got something fun because we are battling our friends at Shrek's Box TV. Now, be sure to check out his channel right after the video because this guy puts out a lot of content, puts in a lot of work behind it, and he's doing a lot of other collabs too with other PokeTubers, so you know he's really getting into the community. Videos are entertaining, and he's just overall a good guy. And if you take a look right over here, we are battling with the one and only Double Blister Packs from Darkness Ablaze. So we got a total of 10 blister packs, aka 20 packs, which means 20 chances to rack up some good amount of points. And in terms of points, we're gonna be doing one point for any hollow rare, two points for any reverse rare hollows or any V card, three points for any V maxes, four points for full arts, and five points for V maxes. Now, I may have gotten the list wrong, so I'm gonna include a screenshot just to make sure that we got everything right over here. But, anyways, enough of that, and let's get right into the opening. I also forgot to mention we also have a trump card of the video, so if any one of us pulls that VMAX Charizard, then that's an automatic win. Alright, so we got all the packs separated. We got Darkness Ablaze in this pile and Sword and Shield in this one. Ten in each stack. We'll set aside the packs right over here, and we're gonna start off with the one and only Darkness Ablaze. Alright, you guys, and we also got some bad news too, because I bought these from GameStop for the retail price of $3.99. You know, that's regular price unless you buy at Target, which is like $4.20. But anyways, yeah, we bought these from GameStop, and... This was about like two weeks ago too, and they still had a lot in stock. Oops, I did the card trick wrong. But anyways, there is the code card. One, two, three, and a four. We didn't put one pot aside because I'm trying to talk at the same time. So we got Metal Saucer. But anyways, yeah, we bought these from GameStop. And yeah, two weeks ago, everything was all good. But now I checked again, and it turns out it is out of stock on GameStop. Not only online, but at my physical stores too. So I don't know if they're going to ever restock on this. Reverse holo swana. Okay, so we got two points right off the bat and a gram ball non holo. Hey, that's still two points, so that's good, that's good. Sword and shield. And as I was saying, yeah, everything is out of stock. So I checked, like, you know, other stores like Target, Walmart, Best Buy. And it seems as if these are really just sold out now. Like, I don't know if they're ever gonna do a restock because it seems like a limited print run. I don't know why I think that, but I really think they're not gonna bring these back. I mean, you could still buy these, but it's gonna be not for the retail price of $3.99. People are charging for like $7 or $8 per thing. So if you guys can find them, go ahead and swoop in. But yeah, terrible news, man. I was expecting these to last a little bit longer, but obviously, like, when Darkness of Blaze came out, a lot of people hopped on it, so... That sucks, but on the bright side... Got Psychic Energy. But on the bright side, we do have Champion's Path coming in next week. Or actually this week to be exact, and I might get mine early too, because I purchased mine from Darium's, and he actually shipped his out a week earlier. Reverse rare? Nope, reverse on common and a... Eh? Ooh, hollow Rhyperior rare, so we are racking up three points. And I will put a counter just in case I miss track of how many hits we got. But yeah, as of now, I believe we got three. Back to Darkness Ablaze. Ooh, we got that Charizard pack art too. We got Pettis. We got the code card. Paris off to the side. One, two, three, and a four. So yeah, he shipped out the Elite Trainer boxes on Friday. So apparently I'm supposed to get mine on Monday. So I, we might be able to get an early unboxing, which is... I'm really excited for that because I was trying to go to stores or to local stores too and physically wait it out and swoop some when they stock it up. But I really don't know because I do work that day. Hold on, you guys. Another reverse rare? Are you serious? So we have five and now we got... Oh. Alright, we're keeping it at 5, but this is actually my first time doing a pack battle where we count the reverse hollows, but reverse hollow rares. And I do think that's kind of uh, neat because I think reverse hollow rares might be rarer than hollow rares. Because anything could be in that reverse slot, right? So, I don't know. Back to sword and shield, we got Sobble. And we also got a code guard. Alright, Sobble off to the side. One, two, three, and a four. But luckily, I was able to pre-order some on GameStop and other sellers from the Burbank Pokemart Center or whatever. And they haven't been cancelled, so I'm happy with that. But I'm not gonna get those on time because they're gonna ship it out on release day, so I'm probably gonna get that a week later. So I'm really glad Darium's sending out his stuff a week early. Ooh, Toxicroak, Hello Rare. See, I'm already, I think I already lost track, but I think we're at 6 right now. Back to Darkness Ablaze. And you guys, we still have not pulled of Charizard VMAX, even though we opened I a couple dozen. I think we might have hit a hundred packs that we opened, and we still haven't hit that Charizard VMAX. But, I mean, that's a good thing, because if we are gonna hit it, it's really good that we're gonna hit it today, because we might need it. Start really off to the side. One, two, three, four. Because Shrexbox actually opened his packs already, and recorded his part of the video, and he already told me his score, so I already know what to beat. And, 
we're gonna need that Charizard VMAX, I think. Now, I don't know what he pulled because he just told me the points. Ooh, Poltergeist. Reverse Uncommon. Yes, that is an Uncommon. Okay, and a Mel Metal non hollow Sword and Shield. And you guys should also watch his other videos with the other collabs he's done with other Poketubers because... And one of them, I don't want to spoil it too much, but he had some pretty crazy hits. Like, okay, I'll spoil a little bit. He hit a couple Zards in one video. I was like, dude, I really hope you used all your luck in that one because I don't want you to wreck us too bad in this one. Energy Surge, Team Yell Grunt. But are they yelling or grunting? The world may never know. Goldeen, Salandit Reverse, just a regular uncommon, and Sandaconda, non hollow. All right, Darkness Ablaze. And I believe we're at six points. We'll see what the counter says, but. I think we're at 6. I'm gonna have to keep on reminding myself about the score because if I just don't say it out loud, then I'm probably gonna forget what we have. Gold Guard, Galarian Mr. Mime. Off to the side. 1, 2, 3, and a 4. Oof. We got the fists. Flaffy, Carnivine, Big Parasol. Ooh, I wanna hit that in the gold card. Like, I'm on a collecting spree with gold cards right now, even if they're not that rare. Rose Tower, Uncommon, and a... Ooh, Tyranitar Hollow! Now, if I was correct about having 6 points, we are at 7. So we'll put you aside. And I'm also not sleeving those guys up. I don't know why. Back at it again with the Sword and Shields. Now, I honestly have not been keeping track of how many packs we've opened. But I think we're halfway now, after this one. Should be. Not too sure. Alright, we're off to the side. We got 1, we got 2, we got 3, and we got 4. And as I was saying before too, I'm liking how we're counting the reverse hollow rares. Because even if you see the code card and it's a green card, we can still get some points out of it. So, it leaves us some hope. Yamper, Pokemon Center Lady, aka Nurse Joy. Y'all disrespecting my ladies. And Snorlax, not hollow. Alright, so we got one, two, three, four, and a five. Yes, so we are halfway now. And we did rack up some points. But I don't think it might be enough. Because in our last pack battle, we took an L, and I think we're going to do that back-to-back, -back, man. Two Ls. Lamau. Jigglypuff. One, two, three, and a four. Come on, come on, come on. Let's go with the Agua. Gotharita. Kabu, no top. Turbo Patch. I want to hit that in a gold card as well. Dunsparce. Clink. Morini. Stock and Corsola. R.I.P. Corsola. Torchic. Dartrix. And a... Oof. The ice cream boys. Sword and shield, let's get it, let's go. We got silly Cobra being angry. And we got a code card. Now Cobra, why are you angry? Is it because we're not gonna get a hit in this pack? Let's see, let's see. We got Aura Energy. Double Quillfish, Mencino, Volpix, Muna, Roselia, Mud Bray Reverse and a Oof, Silly Cobra, you are right about being angry. Whimsicott, non hollow. Alright, our six blister pack. I might be wrong about that, honestly. Oh man. We got Bunnelby being on a crazy trip right now. Alright, code card. Bunnelby to the side. One, two, three, four. That was four. I thought I miscounted. I got lightning. We got Ariados. Familiar Bell. Rose Tower. Toxel, Sinisty, Carablast, Meltan, Heatran, oh, wait a minute, yeah, everybody, we just got a reverse hollow, nine points, I believe, and a oh, Trachazolt, okay, non hollow, okay, good thing we got this boy. Yeah, you guys, we're not looking too hot right now. Now, if you guys didn't watch my previous Darkness Ablaze opening, we opened up the Blister case that had 24 packs in him, and in the first half of it, we did really well, in the second half, we did terrible. So as of now, it looks like we're hitting a similar pull rate as the second half of that case, blister case. We got Leaf, Doug Trio. Yeah, at this point, I think we might need that Charizard. Like I already called it in the beginning, but this just solidifies it. Score Bunny, Sinisty, Professor's Research, Reverse Hollow. Ooh, it's a rare 11, and what can we get with the- <gasps> Ooh, a full art! Delmize! And last time too in our opening, all of our hits came from Sword and Shield, and it looks like we're about to repeat that. We got Sword and Shield sleeves to go along with it. Sleeve up. Alright, sleeved up. And you already know, we gotta put the full arts in a top loader. Alright, top loaded up as well. So I believe that counts for 15 points, but still, we got a long ways to go. Mr. Mime dancing his life away. 
go. Code card. And we got ourselves mime to the side. One, two, three, and a four. We got Darkness Ablaze. Dartrix. Staravia. Shenotic. Electrive. Dino. Passimian. Bunnel B. Larry on reverse and A. Darkness of Blaze is really not treating us well. But we know Sword and Shield will. Watch, this is a hit. I guarantee this is going to be a hit. Rookity. Rookity. To the side. One, two, three, four. Alright, Metal Saucer. Fawake. Poke Gear. Aura Energy. Krabby. Grookey. Mudbray, Hoots Hoots, Ball Toy, and a... Ouch. Durant, no Kevin. Not hollow. Alright y'all, three more blister packs left, aka six more packs. We gotta get the ball rolling. And we got Pan Sage, aka Broccoli Head Boy. Alright, and the code card. And I did mention my previous video too that I am going to be doing live openings on Twitch now and it's going to be breaks. So um, I have not thought of the prices for the packs I'm going to be opening but I did make it official that I'm going to be opening up Burning Shadows first. So if you want to pre-order any packs I might be opening a hundred of them just go ahead and send me an email. But I do have to figure out the whole logistics behind Twitch so um, yeah just go ahead and follow me I'm going to link my Twitch account below. Is this reverse? Oh, I'm coming! <gasps> Salamance VMAX, yo! Now this is a card I really, really wanted. Now the whole Salamance line in this set is beautiful. Now hold on, we said three points for a VMAX, but this is a full art card. So we might have to straighten things out there, but mm, this card is beautiful. Now if this is considered a hit, I think we're at 19 now. I think we're at 19. What was it, 23? It's already bad, y'all. I'm gonna stop trying to remember the score because I'm gonna just make it worse for myself. But we are going to put you in a top loader and sleeve. Now for cards that I really, really enjoy, I do double sleeve them. So let's go and get this going. First off, we got the perfect fit sleeve. Ooh, nice and snug. Darkness of Blaze sleeve to go along with this. Hold on. We actually put the sleeve in wrong because you're supposed to put it inverted. Or upside down, I should say. This is watch. I think we're supposed to put it in upside down. Oh, y'all see the shakes already? Hold on, gotta put my forearms on the table. There we go. Beautiful. There you go. That's the correct way because when you put it in the other sleeve, you want the exposed side on the bottom. There you go. Beautiful. And on top of that, we got triple protection because we're gonna put this in the top loader as well. Oof. And look at that beauty. Now, I feel like this is a good way to store your cards and protect them. But the thing is, when I do this, take a look at the bottom, you guys. Let me see if I can get it in focus. There is a large gap at the very bottom. It might be trapped air, but I just want to get your guys' opinion on this too, because is this going to affect the card in the, in the long run? So, I mean, there is a way to fix it. You just put a lot of cards stacked on top of it so the air pushes out. But yeah, just want to let y'all know if you're going to do this technique too. All right, sword and shield. Let's get it popping. Got that Klabapuspus. Here we go. Code card. Klabapuspus. To the side. One, two, three. I don't know why I was gonna do three, but my mind just went straight to three. I right, seeking Hitmonchan with Hitmolee in the back. Great ball. Cottony with the whole squad of Cottony. Look at that. Got a whole tree of them. Judel. Right horn. Rookery. Ooh, Dreadnought. Is this a rare? All right, two points right there. I lost track, and we got a Ooh Cinderace Hollow. We haven't pulled this card yet. Nice. So this whole pack was a total of three points, but. I do not know the total. Oof, look at that. And I thought we were going to end off on a Charizard pack, but we're not. Second to last pack, so that's pretty good. And no one gets the Charizard in a Charizard pack, so maybe this is a good thing that we're not ending off on a Charizard pack. Alrighty. Code card. Qfont being cute. We got one. We got two. We got three. And we also got four. I burped. Darkness ablaze. Vibrava. Simaseer, Luna Toon, looking in the mirror because he's looking at the moon. Ooh, that kind of rhymed. Phoebus drowning somebody, and his move is nap. Come on, that's why he's drowning. He's not paying attention. Passimian, whoops. Fletcher Ling Ling, Purloin, look at that. Finessed me with the reverse hollow because you can't see the hollow on here. And a Star Raptor, non hollow. All right, sword and shield. Let's see if we can get another hit in here. You guys, I think we might be catching up. 
Like, I'm not gonna tell you his score because I want y'all to watch his video too. And if you're watching his video, make sure to subscribe, alright? Goldine to the side. We got one, two, three, and a four. The Agua. Hitmon Lee with Hitmon Chan, okay. Salazzle, Metal Saucer. Whoops! I'm like grabbing multiple cards. Roselia. Joltik. Silly Cobra being silly. Blipbug. Pharaoh Seed Reverse. And a Cramorant V. So this is two points, okay. I was on the brink of saying you don't deserve a sleeve because this guy is just weird, but I will put you in a sleeve, alright? We don't discriminate here. Alright, Cramorant V. Now if you guys played the game, I love his animation when he does an attack with the... I think it was a Barrascuta in his mouth. Oh, they should really make a VMAX card with a bear skewed in his mouth. Now that card, I will enjoy. You already know we're gonna end off with Darkness Ablaze, so we gotta open this sword and shields. Now let's see if we can get that last blister pack magic. And this one opened up real ugly. Hello, Volpix. Code card. And then Volpix. Oops. Volpix to the side, so we keep everything a surprise. One, two, three, and a four. Alright, let's get it popping. We got the Fuego. <laughs> I like that. Lucky Egg. Nickets. Ball Toy. Or Baby Blade. Chin Chow. Krabby. Shelter Reverse. And a. Oof. Dreadnought Not Hollow. Alright, you guys. It's official. We took it now, but let's see if this last pack saves us. We might need a Secret Rare. Or you know what? Let's just go with the Charizard VMAX so we can solidify this win. If we don't get it, then. It's okay, I don't mind having two L's on my record. I've been losing my whole life. Code card for y'all. Vanilla light to the side. We got one, two, three, and a four. All right, let's get it. Three, two, and one. Metal saucer, all right. Flaffy, Carnivine, Big Parasol, Gothita, Nicket, Shelmet with the Duck Lips, Lovatar, Oh, clang, click and clang, reverse rare, all right, that's plus two and a plus zero Ampharos, non hollow, god lord. So this means we gotta hit it with the recap. All right, so we're gonna go by least points to the most points, and the least points we can get is the regular hollows. So we'll start off with those. We got Cinderace, one point, Rhyperior rare, two, Toxicoke rare, three, Tyranitar, four, and here we go, we got the reverse rare now, two points, six, 8, 10, ooh, 12, and then Cramorant V, which is 14, Domize V, which should be 4 points, and the biggest hit of today's opening is that Salamance V. But technically, it's supposed to be 3 points, but I don't know, this is a full art, correct? Because of the texture and whatnot, so we'll check it out, but for sure we hit less than 20, so well, there you go. But anyway, you guys, go ahead and check out his video to see who got the L handed to them. But while you're there, go ahead and subscribe to his channel as well. That about wraps it up for this pack battle, alright? So y'all already know what to do. Hit like, hit subscribe, and hit the notification bell for these guys right over here. Alright? For these guys, because the earlier you're here, the better of a chance you have at grabbing one of these, alright? And I'll see you on the next opening. Peace.